As an enterprise security analyst, examining suspicious activity is an essential part of your job. So when you get an alert that somewhere on your network systems are connecting to a suspicious URL, it's time to take action. We've got multiple correlated events here, all triggered by the same URL. This looks like something that needs further analysis. Seamless integration with ESM makes it easy to move right into ArcSight Investigate, but you can also launch the tool independently to analyze any situation. With ArcSight Investigate, intuitive and powerful investigation tools are just a click away. The system opens with the search box already populated with relevant information, and you can broaden the search to any URL on the target domain using Investigate's smart suggestions and natural language search tools. All of the data you'll need for your investigation is right in front of you, and you can customize the fields you'll see or choose from one of your personalized field sets to respond to threats more quickly. ArcSight Investigate combs through millions of data points in seconds to show you all activity in the past seven days. You can immediately see that two users have visited the URL, Tom Harris in marketing and Emily Falvey in accounting. You need to know what might have happened to their systems, so your first step is to examine the network traffic from these two users to see if anything changed after they visited the URL. The easiest way to do this is with a visualization. In just a few clicks, you create a chart that shows outgoing traffic over time for the past seven days. You want to establish a baseline of user behavior in the entire organization. It's easy to process data in different ways by simply clicking on a field. Calculating the average number of bytes out per day is very intense, but ArcSight Investigate takes the average of 2 million events gathered from all users in the organization and updates the chart instantly. To compare the averages to the users you're investigating, you modify the chart with a few clicks. Then, you simply drag in the appropriate field and choose a username to focus in on how their traffic looks next to an average user. The first user looks pretty normal, so let's add Tom Harris to the chart to see if his data usage is any different. Okay, this looks like a problem. Harris's system had a huge spike in traffic after visiting the suspicious URL. You'd better save this visualization to your dashboard to refer to it as you continue your investigation. These charts update in real time, so you can come back to it after taking action to see if the problem is still there. The type of traffic is as important as the amount, so you create a second visualization that builds a pie chart of the data by protocol coming out of Tom's system. Again, building a visualization is as easy as dragging in the right fields and setting the variables to show a clear breakdown of his activity. The biggest wedge of the pie is HTTP, which makes sense, but the large amount of SSH traffic makes this look like a compromised system. Now that you've got the threat in your sites, you want to monitor this activity to see how it evolves over time. You have Harris's system under observation, and you can easily find other compromised systems by creating a rule in ESM. If the system sees a user visit a suspicious URL, then detects an activity spike to more than 10 times the organization average, you'll get an alert. And ArcSight Investigate's powerful visualization abilities mean that you can see the outcome of advanced analytical queries right in your dashboard. To find out more about how ArcSight Investigate can transform your threat investigations, visit hpe.com slash software slash investigate.